Hey everyone, it's Mafia Game Videos MGV, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about the latest update for Mafia Definitive Edition. Now, this is the first update for Mafia Definitive Edition, and it adds a couple new things. The first thing is the Nor mode, which makes it black and white, and the second thing is it adds the ability to dis disable the HUD. You can disable the map on the bottom right hand corner of the screen when you're driving, so you won't see the map, and you can also disable the uh, if you're playing not on classic, if you're playing on normal, uh, you, you can disable the stop signs, the waypoints that tell you go left to right, the navigation, and you can also disable the objective indicator. And you can also disable enemy markers, and that looks about it. And let's start it. It looks pretty cool and black and white. And they added two new things to free ride. They added races and taxi drivers, taxi driving missions. So here's the game in black and white. And right when you start the game, you see this sign, Lost Heaven Autodrome. Let me first change it to color so you guys can see it better. Go to, there it is. It says, come for practice, come to race. And you have to go to the autodrome. As you can see on the bottom right hand corner, there's nothing, it's blank. And the HUD is gone. To re-enable the HUD, all you do is go to options and go to game and all the way down, go to HUD visibility and set it to full or minimal. If you set it to full, as you can see the the HUD radar is back and to disable it all you do is go to game HUD visibility and set it to minimal to turn it off and now it looks way cleaner and then you as you can see we're at the autodrome and the gates blocked what you do is go around the building if you go around the building you see these levers and you just press the button prompt and you'll see what happens next <laughs> And then it, it unlocks three parking spots. And then you can take any vehicle you have in your garage. And here, one second. Yeah, see, that's the first one, the second one, and third one. And I'm going to take my car real quick. And on the bottom left, it will tell you. See, this one says it is five laps. The middle one's five laps. The third one is 10 laps, and the first one is three laps. You don't get any reward for completing all of them, which I was very disappointed. I thought you would have unlocked the Smith Thrower. And the first thing you might have noticed in this race is it's like a Mario Kart. They added a bunch of new stuff. They added guns, you can shoot other cars, uh, oil spills, dynamite, and uh, nitro. Now, you can't blow up the cars, so if you throw a dynamite at them, the, the car's not going to blow up. They're just It's just going to slow them down. And you're just, it's pretty easy uh, if you're playing on normal. On classic, I'm assuming it's uh, difficult as usual and look right there the dynamite went in motion and i'm gonna do the first uh the first whole uh racing mode three laps uh i'm just gonna show you guys it but i'm not gonna show you guys the second the five laps and ten laps because it's exactly the same so i'll just stop talking right now and let you guys enjoy it
And there we go, we just won free ride. Now, no one tells you this, but do not uh, put on newer mode. Don't put on the black and white mode because that would, that would just mess up your game. Because as you can see, I ran out of gas for some reason. I can't, uh, I can't even race. I was in first and then now I'm in last place and I can't even pick up objects when I put it into a uh, newer mode, the black and white. And the cool thing is you can drive any car that you have in your garage and as you can see I'm driving a motorcycle, the Black Cats one that you get for linking your 2k account and it's pretty cool driving a motorcycle. And also if you go to the bus stop signs on the bottom left it'll pop up that you can teleport to Salieri's. Uh, I'm pretty sure not many people know that. And I'm gonna, tr I'm gonna start the taxi missions right now so what you do is pick uh, the taxi car, I'm picking the Sherbert 6 taxi, and you just drive around, and then less than 30 seconds later, someone will pop up and say, hey taxi, and then you just stop right over there, and you pick them up, and you just, you're just you just the taxi driver, you pick them up and drop them off, and you can do this for infinite amount of times, it's not a mission, it's like forever, it's like Skyrim. It's like one of those missions that keeps resetting and resetting at random. So I thought this was an amazing feature that they added. And I just can't wait to see what else they add in the future. I really hope that they add enemy AIs in the, uh, what do you call it, in the free ride. Because I'm tired of killing police officers. <laughs> I see a lot of comments, people saying I hate the police. That's not true at all. The police are the only people that I can try out the animations. And I would just love to see Morello's gang in Freeride and fight them. But other than that, I'm loving these updates. Props to Hangar13 for listening to the fans. And I, I, I'm just loving and loving this game. Let me know what you guys think about this update in the comments below. And enjoy the rest of the video. problem, sir. Place, park, scene, dark, silvery moon is shining through the trees. Cast to me, you, sound of kisses floating on the breeze. Act one, be...